Hi everyone, pick a mix gamer it. Today we're using Ace, the sixth survivor. <clears throat> I'm taking in a toolbox, 16 charges, brand new part, and a wire spool which adds 12 charges, so that would be 28 charges. Uh, murky region is it greatly thickens the dark mist the three main perks ace perks i'm using open-handed ace in the hole up the ante open-handed uh, strengthens team's aurora reading abilities increases aurora reading ranges by eight meters so if someone's got a reading ability where they see people's auroras it's increased by eight meters ace in the hole when retrieving an item from a chest, there is a 100% chance that a very rare or lower add-on will be attached to it. And a 50% chance of finding an add-on of uncommon rarity or lower. So, it might be a common item, but there's a very strong chance you'll get at level 3. All of these perks are at level 3, by the way. There's a very strong chance you'll get a very rare or an uncommon rarity, which is good. Uh, up the ante... Each of the survivors still alive grants a 3% bonus of luck to all remaining survivors. So, <clears throat> Ace's confidence fills others with the feeling of hope for those around you. So for every survivor still in the match alive, they get a 3% bonus of luck to, to everyone, basically. And uh, the fourth perk I'm using is Spine Chill. Whenever you look in the direction of the killer and whenever he's coming towards you, it's got a 36 metre range and then while it's active, skill trigger odds are increased by 10% with successful zones reduced by 10%. While spine chill is active, you speed while repairing, sabotaging, healing, unhooking, vaulting, cleansing, opening exit gates and unlocking is increased by 6%. So that's not too bad. So, with any luck, this will be a good match. So let's get started, because I've been lucky so far. <laughs> okay. Sounds like we've got the Chainsaw Massacre guy. Oh, bloody hell. Hang on a minute. Right, Spike, so he's somewhere over there, because Spine Chill's got, just gone off. Okay. Right, spine chill, which means he's sort of tottering over here. <clears throat> well, he is tottering over here. I think he was just after Claudette then. So, I think I'll be hiding in a locker if I can find one, which I can. Oh, I've got a minute. Alright, let's see if there's a totem nearby. No, not one here. There's usually one here. Give me a minute. Oh, 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 oh. Don't know where he is. Can't. Oh, there he is. There he is. Right, okay. So he's over there, sort of out the way. Oh. No, he's not. I'm gone. Oh, oh my god. Jesus, he just missed me. Sod you, mate. Right, let's try and get this done as quick as we can. Probably chasing someone, might not be. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Go, 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 go. Right, let's just check. Right, no totem in here, that's alright. I mean, it's not alright, because it means ideally I'd like to find one, because I've not got the detective tap perk on. So if he has got no one escapes death, we're a bit screwed. <laughs> right. Let's just check here. There's usually totems in these bits here. And oh, ah! oh, I knew he'd catch me, but get away from me. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, and he had that attack on, so if someone gets hurt, you can, like, if someone's... Oh, God, she was trying to heal me. Damn it. Well, <clears throat> the good news is we've got two generators left, so that's not too bad. And that generator's sort of more or less nearly done. <laughs> Come on. Right, is anyone else here doing any other generator? And I've got a health med kit as well if I need it. 
Right, come on, get me off the hook. Thank you, Quadet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Seriously. Uh, and I'll. S oh god, don't start glitching like that. Right, come on. Med kit. Okay, I've got some stuff that can speed it up. I'm all right, love. I don't need your help. Yeah. Right. Okay. Right, he's over there. Try and help up with this as quick as I can. Come on, you lot. We can do this. We can get out. Boom! Right, okay. One last generator. Oh, sugar. I nearly did it. I nearly swore. <clears throat> okay. Ah! I forgot that. I forgot he had that perk on. Oh, bloody hell, bloody hell. Right. Oh. Right, I'll try and get to her and heal her as quick as I can, but I'm going to have to be a bit careful. Oh. Okay, just sort of creep around here a bit. I ain't got urban evasion on. Right, come on, come on, come on. Right, just run away temporarily. Oh, Claudette, I thought you were going after the other one. Right, hang on a minute. Oh, oh, right, he's picking her up. Right, okay. Bill, I was going to try and heal you. Oh, God, he dropped her. Did he drop her? Oh, nice one. Claudette got him to drop her. Nice. Right, okay, so best thing I think I can do right now. I can't see where they've gone, so I can't... Re oh, there she is. Oh, right, he's chasing her. Damn it! Right, best thing I can do really is just aim for a generator, because I'd love to heal, but let's face it, I don't... I can't really see them in that respect. I know they're coming over here because I've just seen the hillbilly, but... Right, so he's there. Oh, Totem, Totem. No, 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 come here, come here, come here. There we go. Get, get one of you sorted. Okay, she's all healed. All right, you caught Bill. I didn't even see him catch Bill. Right. One more generator. And he's over there somewhere. Right. Okay, I'm gone. Oh, bloody hell, he was right there. I had no idea he were right there then. Oh yeah, spine chills a good one to use as well because it doesn't have an exhaustion. I forgot to mention this, it doesn't have an exhaustion perk on it, so every time the killer is coming in your direction, like say like if he was coming from that that direction now and it glowed up, it you don't have to wait at any time limit, you know, to use it again, so that's why it's ideal. Oh, we've nearly got this one done. Oh, yes, nice. Oh, exit gate right there. Get in, you beautiful thing. Now, I've got one more hook in me, so it's not too bad. I can't see him coming over yet, but the only problem is the other gate's just over there, so they're really close to each other. Right. Oof, oof, oof. Right, she's off the hook. <clears throat> and he would have seen me scratch marks. Oh my god, I'm screwed. I screwed up. I screwed up. Not intentionally. I unintentionally screwed up. Come on. Right, sorry. Sorry to leave. Sorry. 
Oh, right. <clears throat> well, I got the gates at least. We're just going to spectate a little bit, see if people get out. Because I felt a bit bad then. I didn't think you were going to catch me that quick. <laughs> okay. Right, she's found the arch. She's at the exit gate, waiting. Oh, it's so annoying when people do that. Right, he's found the exit gate. So they're getting there, they are getting there. She's waiting for the arch. <laughs> there we go. It does take a few seconds for the hatch to open, though. What are you doing? Just get out! Ugh, oh, mind you saying that. She might be trying to do rift achievements as well. Come on, out you go. Out you go. Let's see, do a little snail slide across the floor. Come on. Oh, and she's got caught now because of what she's done. Oh, that stupid person. See what I mean? That's all she had to do. But saying that, though, I don't think she did it deliberately. I think she did it because I don't think she knew that Claudette, you know, if she was in trouble or not. Oh. But it seems heartless, but this is why you should always leave when you get the chance, you know, after a few seconds, if no one looks like they've been hooked. Because if they have found the hatch, they can't use it until everyone's out the trial or unless they have a key. Anyway, <clears throat> that's it for this video. If you liked it so far or if it helped in any way, please leave a like and subscribe. And please leave a comment as well to let me know what you think. Right, and then you look, I'll see you in the next video. So bye and stay safe.